have welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be doing a clothing haul for you guys and i really hope you enjoy it the first piece that we have is from a brand called house of cb it is a uk brand and i heard so many good things about just the quality of their clothing and everything else so this top is called the evie top got it in a large and sizes are super weird when it's uk versus america so if you're a medium say in america you will most likely be a large in the UK or a extra large, which is kind of confusing, but measurements on their website and stuff, so don't worry about that. So that Evie top also comes with matching bottoms. So it's a little bit on the pricey side, a lot of it on the pricey side, but I'm really excited to see how this looks. I really need like a cute like matching set, so I really love the bottoms. I think they're super cute. I think the top is slightly too large, like right here. So I'm gonna have that brought in, and then these straps need to be up a little bit higher so it supports my ladies. But other than that, I think it's really cute and super flattering and it's very comfortable just for like a chill kind of day but I do like this a lot. I would definitely say that this is worth it. Just make sure you get it in the right size. And if you do get it in the wrong size, you can just tailor it. It's always better to size up instead of sizing down because if you size down, then you have to either return it or give it away or deal with that. But if you do size up and it is a little too big like this is for me, then I can always go and get it tailored. But I think the bottoms fit super well. It's just the top that's like slightly baggy. Next, we have these fell leather pants from Maritzia, brand Wolfred, and I got them in a size eight. I can't remember all the top of my head how much these are but I will tag everything down below in my description all the different clothing items I will put a link so you guys can find them so I love these pants I've worn them before but I just wore them a couple days ago but I wanted to include them in this try on haul because they're so freaking cute and then the top that I will pair this with just to show you guys so this super cute corset top is from the house of CB as well it's kind of expensive but it is so, so, so cute. And I really wanna show you guys what this looks like on. The only thing I really don't like about the top is that it's very loose here and my boobies are natural. So they don't kind of like hike them up. So I might take it to the tailor or something and get something to where it is more pressed together. And then I might get the straps a little bit tighter. But other than that, like I really do love this. And I think it would look great with jeans and stuff as well. And once again, I absolutely love the pants. I think they are just like the perfect pair of like faux leather pants and they're very flattering on the booty. Up next, I have this Marla top again from House of CB. It is freaking stunning. It's like latex, super hot, super cute. I had my husband put it on me earlier because you do need help to, I, I need help to get into it. So I'm probably not gonna put it on for this try on haul because he's asleep. I should have gotten it in extra large because in the UK, once again, like sizing is like super different, but I think that if I lose like a little bit more weight, then I'll be able to fit into this slightly better. I just have a really big back <laughs> and arms, but I think this is stunning and it would go really, really nice with like a pair of jeans or like those black leather pants that I had, or maybe even skirt. This is definitely like a super cute, like must have piece and I'm really going to enjoy owning this. So next I have this stunning coat from Babaton, which is an Aritzia brand. And this is $248. I am so excited about it because it is a gorgeous trench coat. And I feel like this is just really great because the material is super light and fluffy and it's not too hot or too cold. So because I live in California, like this will be really great for me to wear on just like casual occasions just to spice up an outfit or add a layer. So I'm really excited about this. And I think it will definitely go with like a lot of my outfits. So I love the color blue so much. Like you'll see me, I, I wear a lot of neutrals. I wear a lot of blue, a lot of black, a lot of tan. And this is like my first brown sort of thing that I've owned, but I do like this a lot. So once again, I love this. Next up, I have this gorgeous silk skirt I'm super excited about. I'm probably gonna wear it with the turtleneck that I'm about to show you, but this is another Aritzia piece by the brand Babaton. Babaton is just really, really good for nice, high quality clothing. I really, really do enjoy Aritzia because no matter what I order from there, Everything is always amazing quality and I love every single piece. That's why I end up buying all of it and I'm not even sponsored. <laughs> and I really need a nice like staple white skirt piece because I feel like you can wear this with like a bralette and a blazer or like a turtleneck. So I am really excited about this piece right here. I don't like that it kind of wrinkles though. I was hoping that it was a material that didn't really wrinkle as much, but I'm probably gonna throw it in the dryer for a little bit before I show you guys what this looks like on my body. So next up I have a turtleneck from a and I really love this a lot. So my husband threw my really nice sweaters and turtlenecks in the dryer, including a really, really nice coat. <laughs> I wanted to kill him. I just bought this to kind of make up for that. I'm pretty sure it was like $150, maybe more, but 
I'll check again before I tell you guys how much this was, but I will also link it down in the description so you guys can go and shop for yourselves. I really love this. I think this is just like a really comfy, cute turtleneck, and it's great because it is a little bit chilly in California right now, so this is like the perfect level of warmth, and I like this a lot. I absolutely love this turtleneck skirt combo. This was both from Aritzia, and I think this is a super classy look with like a really cute like kid needle and some ray bands and maybe my Chanel glasses. I tucked the turtleneck into the skirt, and I think it's a very pretty classy look. And I think it would look really pretty with like a updo or something like that. I definitely love this look. I gotta be careful what this looks like tucked in, otherwise it makes my stomach look funny. But other than that, it's really high quality material and it's super comfy. It's not itchy, which is also a plus. I love the skirt. I think this can go with a lot of different things in my closet. And I think it's just a really super classy look. Really nice for winter, warm enough, you're warm enough on the top got a little skirt action and then like I'll add some kitten heels or something. I have some really nice heels coming in the mail so I'm really excited for that. Next up I have these gorgeous pants from Aritzia, brand called Babaton and they're the Jotham pants. They're high rise, they're slim leg and they go to your ankle and then I got them in a size 8. I love a slit in front of like business casual pants or like a suit because I feel like it just elongates your legs and shows a little bit of shoe. It just allows for some more movement. I am always very hesitant to buy white clothing because I feel like I get everything dirty but I feel like it's good just to have like a pair of white pants so I think I would probably pair this with a black turtleneck or like a really cool blazer or something like that but I really do like these a lot so I absolutely love these pants the only problem is they're definitely see-through because you can see my tattoo through it I feel like you can kind of see my butt crack I do like how this looks with this turtleneck I'm gonna bring out my little trench coat to go with this outfit. I love how this outfit looks with this trench coat with the white pants and the turtleneck sweater. I also just think it hides how see-through these pants are. I'm not gonna return them because I do like them, but they are kind of translucent, but that's the only issue that I have with it. But I wanna show you guys the full outfit. So this is what the entire outfit looks like. I think with the clear shoes, it does look really nice. This outfit as a whole put together, I think it's just really classy. I would definitely wear, see myself wearing something like this in New York, especially because it is really cold right now. Next, I have the Luda pants by House of CB in large. And these are just like super cute, like loungewear PJ pants. I know that this clothing haul is on the more expensive side, but I will definitely put together a less expensive haul for you guys, or like a thrifted haul or something like that. Just let me know if that's something that you'd like to see down in the comments but I love these pants they're so cute I love the way they flare out at the bottom I think flared pants just do look really flattering on me and I might need to get them slightly tailored but I just I love them I love them this is a look super cute lounge look for everyday chillin if you want to look a little bit cute I think these are definite must next up I have a super cute black mini skirt from Aritzia and I think it's just a really awesome, cool, staple piece to have if you want to wear some tights under there, like if it's cold outside and whatnot right now. So this I would probably wear with a turtleneck and pair it with like a really nice blazer. Next up, I just have a staple black turtleneck from Aritzia. And this one is in a large. I switch between getting like turtlenecks in a medium and a large just because some turtlenecks I like like really tight and then some turtlenecks I just like a more loose kind of look. And it's just a super soft, really nice turtleneck neck and I definitely love turtlenecks and I think they look so classy so I have like a bunch of them in different colors um by the way nothing in this video is sponsored this is all stuff that I just bought for myself I kind of had some fun on the internet so don't think that I'm trying to push anything on you I just genuinely love both of these brands and you can get black turtlenecks anywhere you don't need to get the top of the line Aritzia fancy bullshit like you can get like a turtleneck from Ross or Marshalls and get the same exact look that you'll see me in so don't think that you have to buy like super expensive things in order to like match the aesthetic that I have there's ways to go about it and buy cheaper clothing I'm more of a quality over quantity kind of gal like I would rather have like really nice staple pieces that I know will last me for years than buy like all of shine if that makes sense so. love the all black I would probably put some tights underneath because it is so cold right now but I feel so confident in black Next up, I have this stunning white dress from House of CB. I feel like this is just cottagecore dream dress, like big time, and I'm super excited about this for photo shoots in the woods or in a meadow or something like that, or like a really cool photo shoot if I go back to Scotland, which I'm supposed to in February, but I'm not sure if that's going to happen yet because of current travel restrictions, but we'll see. But 
I love this dress and I got this in an extra large. Once again, I will get it tailored if I need to, but I think this would look absolutely stunning on me. And I just picture like a really cool like updo, just like curled hair like I have right now and just like frolicking in a field or something. Oh my God, I think I'm in love with this. Oh my God, it's so pretty. You guys, oh, I love this. Oh, I can, I can zip it myself. That's good. You guys, I'm obsessed with this dress. Oh, you can see my panties. Hold on. <laughs> I'm obsessed. I'm always scared to buy white, but I feel like a little cottagecore fairy like princess. You guys, this is stunning. Oh my god. I think out of everything that I bought, this is my favorite. But the detailing and the puffed sleeves. Next up, I have my favorite pair of professional pants. I had just gotten these a couple days ago. I wore them for like a really cool shoot, a parking garage shoot. It's like my power suit kind of look. And I love these pants because they have this little zipper in the front so it kind of can show off whatever you're wearing. I have these in a size eight. They're the Babaton pants from Aritzia and I will tag the price because I have the tag off already on these ones. I'm gonna show you guys the matching blazer that I got with it as well. So this blazer I got in a size 10. I kind of know to buy personally, like for my body type, a 10 for my broad shoulders and my back, but normally I will have stuff tailored around my midsection. It's just because I have like super broad shoulders and back, but I really do love this classic black blazer. I really love how this fits. Shoulder pads always make me look really good but I think the only thing that I would do is bring in this blazer a little bit. So I'm definitely gonna get this stuff tailored. The pants are super comfortable. The, I really love the slits on the bottom. I would normally wear like a little bit higher of a heel. I feel very professional, but very sexy, and it's a very comfortable suit. I can get away with not wearing a bra with this one, which I do enjoy. I do love the look of this, especially without anything underneath. Now that was the last outfit for this video, but thank you so much for watching and please do not forget to like this video, subscribe, comment, and follow me on my other social media. Love you guys so much. Can't wait to see you for the next one.